my name's Laura Rolls and I'm a fiddler and a teacher from the Isle of Man. So we're going to continue on Culture Bannon's series of instructional videos for beginner fiddle players. And I'm going to teach you a tune today called Ilium Bocht, which means Poor William. Now this is a really lovely tune, but it's also very, very simple. So even the complete beginner will be able to pick this up quite quickly. Right, so I'm going to play it through for you. lovely tune. So this tune is in 3-4 times so we've got three beats in a bar and it's in the key of D major so we're gonna have wide second fingers all the way through the tune. Now I'm gonna play you a little bit of the tune and then we'll have a look at that and then we'll keep adding it together until we've got the whole tune learned. So the first bit just have a listen to this little first bit. So we're going to start off on a wide second finger and this bit's nice because it just really moves by step until the very end when there's a jump. So starting on a second finger and then we're going to go up the scale. So we should finish on a third finger on the A string and then we're going to go right back to the open A at the very end. Should we try that again? So starting on the second finger. Third finger, open. One, two, three, open. Well, have we got that? Let's try one more time. Brilliant, well done. Now the next part's mega easy because it just does that again. So we go twice through that phrase that we've just learnt. Shall we give that a go from the top, but we're gonna do it twice through this time. Well done, okay, one more time, just for look. Excellent, now there's two more little segments that we have to learn until we've got the whole tune. So the next bit, also starts on a on a wide second finger on the D string but this time we're going to go down a note so I'll play you this next little section so this is all on the D string so we're going to move by step to start with so it's going to go two Two. Okay, let's try that again. Excellent, one more time. Okay, let's go all the way back to the beginning. So we've got first phrase we learnt and then we're going to do it again and then we're going to add this little bit on the end. So from the top. And again. And then a 
number two again. Brilliant, last bit, home stretch. So now we're gonna go onto an open A string and it starts on the open A and it goes like this. This is the last bit of the tune, the end of the phrase. Okay, so we've got open one, open one on the A string. So let's just try that. So it goes open one, open one. Fantastic, then back to the D string and we're gonna to go to a number two and then this bit moves by step. Two, one, two, one, open D to finish. Okay, so, okay, so the whole of that phrase. D string. Should we try that last little bit one more time? And then we'll put the whole tune together. So starting on an open A. To so the D string. There we go, that's the whole thing. Let's go right back to the beginning and try the whole tune. So starting on a number two on the D string. We're ready to go. Brilliant, well done. Uh, remember that you can always pause this and rewind if you want to try and go through things again. So don't worry if we're moving too fast for you. You can always just move back a few steps and relearn that bit. Now to finish off, I'm going to play you a harmony part. Now this harmony part is even simpler than the tune because it only uses open strings. So if you've got a complete beginner, they can have a go at this part. This part is so easy. So we're gonna start on the D string. There's two patterns we've got to learn. The first pattern goes open D, open D, open G. Open D to finish. So that's one pattern. And the next pattern goes open D, open A, open A, open D. So if we call these pattern A and pattern B, then the whole tune is going to go A, A, B, A. Okay, so here's the harmony part, and each note on this harmony part lasts for three counts, for three heartbeats. Okay. So here's a test for you to finish off. I'm going to play the super easy part and you guys are going to try and play the tune of the Ilium box over the top and we'll see if they'll fit together. So I'm going to count us in. I'm going to count three to start off with and then let's see if we can play together. So after three, one, two, three. Just play you through once more the tune of Ilium Bokt, just so 
so you can hear it to finish off. Here we go. So I just added in a few ornaments there. And once you're really confident with the tune and you think you know the notes really well, then you can experiment a bit and you can put in your own ornamentation. You can even change some of the notes and improvise a bit around it. Now, if you'd like to see the music for this tune, we've got the notation is in Fiddle Book, which you can buy through the Culture Fandom website, or you can go to um, manxmusic.com and it'll send you a link there as well. So, thank you very much for listening. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Please, if you do manage to learn the tune, record it and send it into Culture Bannon so that they can see how you're getting on. Thank you very much. Bye.